right. <coughs> hmm. All right, hello, greetings, and welcome everyone to this news video. I am the Ninja Nier. I'm not in the middle. Here we go. I am the Ninja Nier, and the topics we're covering today are as follows. Drive the lightning songs. Experience Aptera Solar Calculator. Aptera Introduction. Aptera Track Short. Aptera UI Short. MSN on Aptera and things I liked. Let's get started. All right, so the first thing we're talking about today is a set of videos that I don't know the attribution for. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and scroll down here and make sure Oh, there we go. Okay, so Drive the Lightning does songs now, apparently. Um, they put a song, uh, wrote a song and put it into an AI generator, and this is what the generator came up with um, as far as the music, and I'm assuming, well, the lyrics, and I'm assuming the music, the voice and the music are AI generated. Um, I am not entirely certain about that, so, you know, don't, don't quote me here, but if I am correct. I believe that's what happened. Um, I enjoyed the words of the song and I enjoyed the footage in the background and the music and all that kind of stuff. It is very interesting to see the depth and breadth of what AI can do these days. Um, but yeah, so songs about Aptera. There's two of them. I'm only showing one, uh, but both links are going to be down below. All right, so there is a website by the name of experienceaptera.com, which I will leave in the description along with the link to this particular page. This page will allow you to uh, download a solar calculator that I have been uh, trying so very hard to get downloaded onto my computer, but it will not cooperate. So until such a time as I get that downloaded, I can only reference you guys to a uh, to an Aptera Owners Club video where he talked about the process of actually getting that installed and what have you and he went through a few numbers for what the solar calculator shows and uh, things of that nature. So long story short, if you want the full breakdown, I will link the video and the website down below. But yeah, essentially this is a very cool solar calculator that lets you figure out based on your latitude and your uh, positioning on the planet and all that kind of stuff, how much energy you will actually get based on the information that we have so far about the Aptera. All right, so this video is one that is hosted or, or narrated, I suppose, by Chris McCammon. He put together a video that talks about the basics of the Aptera and everything that we have heard so far about the Aptera and uh, things of that nature. It is a very good video, very well put together, and a lot of topics that were covered were things that people have asked me about. So uh, pretty much every time I've, I've gone to the Aptera website, uh, well, the Aptera YouTube page, and gone for information about things, I usually find the information that I need, and if I don't see it on the Aptera website, somebody else has it, but this is a great conglomeration of all of the information that people normally ask me about the Aptera, in one video. So yeah, this is gonna be my default video for this point uh, moving forward when I talk to people about the Aptera, but yeah. All right, the next story here, Aptera posted a short of them doing track testing. They are moving at a decent pace here and I believe they are on a gentle curve. I see a straightaway here and then a gentle curve that they're moving around toward the end of the video, but yeah, I appreciate that they are showing us that they are doing track testing. I would appreciate a little more though if they had the numbers to share. I know that's coming, it's just my impatience is, is weighing on me, it's, it's getting this like mmm, I want to see it, mmm. But yeah, anyway, love the video, it shows that they are doing something um, noteworthy and that they are constantly keeping us updated about the goings on at Aptera. Um, they are building the future, so you know, the future takes time. All right, so the Aptera UI uh, introduction 
And a uh, quick breakdown here, I did a video about this video already, but I just wanted to mention the fact that it existed, give you the links to my impressions and the video itself down below. All right, and so MSN did a story, uh, well, it looks like a Fox Business News situation, but uh, MSN did a story about the Aptera, and they cited this Fox Business uh, video that does a very good job of explaining what's uh, what Aptera is, and uh, the interviewer does good questions, uh, Steve does a great job of answering said questions, uh, just all around fun video, and it's great that they're getting more exposure, especially by larger news uh, corporations and the like. Alright, the next thing that we're doing here is the things that I liked section. The first thing that I liked is a video by Drive the Lightning where they uh, made it a point to go through the uh, what is the Aptera video. It was very fun to watch and I always love the, uh, the little um, screen thing that they put over the, uh, the overlay for the video. A uh, little cat sliding down the thing here and uh, you can see the, the, the rest of the cats and the Drive the Lightning team and um, one of them is interacting with the logo. It, it's just I enjoy the fact that they do these types of videos and it's just a, a fun idea to watch um, watch the video and have them react to it in real time in like a movie theater type situation so uh, very fun to watch very fun to look at um, yeah good stuff man all right this next thing that I liked is by a channel that I've talked about once before they are called Wings, Wheels, and Wires. I got their name wrong last time. I think I mixed up Wheels and Wires. But yeah, they are a channel that has some of the most balanced takes I've ever seen about different things related to EVs. In this case, they're talking about the EV mandate, uh, or lack thereof because it never existed, and what it means for the auto industry. Uh, he even goes into some detail about what he believes should happen with respect to an EV mandate if there were to be one put in place, which again, there still is not. So, uh, well, and there never was. All right, the last thing that I like this week, uh, surprise, surprise, drive the lightning again. Uh, this is a video about the history of the solar EV industry, as it were, or at least the recent history. They go over the differences between Aptera and the other two uh, solar vehicle companies, uh, Sono Motors and Lightyear. Um, yeah, it's just a really good video. Uh, just, yeah, consistently good. They are consistently good. So I appreciate them for that and I will always give prop to, props to those who I see that are doing a, a lot with respect to the Aptera community and making sure that we stay informed. All right, ladies and gents, that will be the end of this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I am once more than engineer. If you like this video, please do the youtube -y things, like, subscribe, comment, all that kind of fun stuff, and I will catch you guys next time.